All right. Welcome to the bench. So I've installed a bus Leo. Check this out. So if the quad was to crash and um, sometimes they eject, they eject the battery. So in the crash, the battery just unplugs. Um, I do have it really secured though. So I put a strap over my XT60 connector and onto the battery. So it's always like strapped on the side anyway, like that. So it never, it's never gonna eject. But let's say that it does, or um, this one of these power cables rips out, and the quad is a couple hundred meters away from me, and I need to go and find it. They're really hard to see. Or in bush, it could be up in a tree, whatever. So um, this thing here, it's a buzzer, and it's a hundred decibels. It's hardwired into this motherboard. Look, I've soldered it onto the motherboard, the flight controller. And what happens is when this thing, it's got its own battery backup inside there. There's a little LiPo battery. Apparently it's got hours and hours of, um, of activation. So what happens is when it detects that there's no battery plugged in, so there's no power anymore, it starts buzzing. Check this out. Yeah, how are we gonna do this? I have to put my phone down. Holy move for a second. Ready? So there it is. Yeah. So now it's active. See, it's got the red LED. So it's telling me that it's good to go. Now what happens is when we disconnect the battery, see what happens. We disconnect the battery. So there's no power. The quad is probably lost in the bush somewhere and you need to find it. Yeah. So watch this. It's detected that is there's no power. It gives you time to swap batteries or, you know, just in case it's not lost. You could be just working on it. Here we go. Now it's, you haven't activated it. So it starts to be. That's 110 decibels. And it's, and, it's, and it's going to keep doing this until I deactivate the buzzer. So that's, and then all I gotta do is hold this button down. It's just here. For a couple of seconds. And that's it. So that's a security, a good insurance in case you lose your buzzer. Oh, and check this out also, look. I've got my... Um... Got my microscope set up so I can see the board. That's the two small solder joints that I had to do. They're very tiny, so it helps when you've got a microscope like that. It's way better than those magnifying glass things. That is a piece of crap. So there it is. I've got to put it back together now. Yeah. Hey, Ollie, we got to put it back together? Yeah. Good boy. Ollie's helping me.